Will Bernardo Silva be joining Paris Saint-Germain this summer transfer window? That's exactly what I'm going to be answering in this video. We're going to be looking at every single report, what needs to happen for this signing to happen, and how much of a probability it is to happen. First of all, let's go through the reports. First one here from Lekip. After six years at Manchester City, Bernardo Silva hopes to have a new project next season. PSG is a destination that he likes a lot. Bernardo Silva is PSG's number one goal in his position. Luis Campos knows the player very well since he was the one who spa him in reserve at Benfica before signing him for Monaco in 2014. The two men have continued to exchange in recent years. Last July and August, Luis Campos had already tried to poach the Portuguese from City without success. It is not said that there will be more in the coming weeks, but Bernardo Silva continues to be a very receptive to Parisian interest. In private, he does not hide that his destination is tempting in a city where he sometimes spends free time, some even assure that he has already taken information on the places where it is it best to live as a player in the region. Bernardo Silva is not instinctive to the interest of PSG. He already had an agreement last summer with Paris. The player ticks all the boxes wanted by Luis Campos. Paris is not all in all in the file either. Last season, FC Barcelona also tried it. The Spanish club is currently exploring other avenues more concretely, including the return of Lionel Messi, which leaves more room for Paris Saint-Germain. Confirmation, Bernardo Silva is very interested in leaving for PSG. The player would welcome a return to France. Bernardo Silva, when we go through all of these reports he pretty much has has succeeded and done so much at Manchester City and he feels he wants a new project he, wa he wants to be a part of something new he's been so long at Manchester City and I think it's between Paris Saint-Germain FC Barcelona the two clubs that were after him last summer and uh, yeah they're gonna fight for his signature now and as I said he has two years left on his contract 28 year old so in his prime and a market value for 80 million but with it only being two years left on his contract I believe uh, we can try to get him for around the 60 million mark and as I said it's a battle between Paris Saint-Germain FC Barcelona both uh, teams want this player. Both teams have been after this player. Obviously, economically, we have a step over Barca. I mean, they're broke. We're not <laughs> for the first time in I don't know how long. But I believe, I actually believe if you ask Bernardo Silva about the two options, I think he would prefer, honestly, a move to FC Barcelona. That's just my opinion. But as I said, economically wise, it helps us. And second of all, it all depends on Lionel Messi because Bernardo Silva is the replacement for Messi if he leaves. But for Barca, it's also the same. If they don't get Messi, they will get Bernardo Silva. So it all depends on where Lionel Messi goes. If Lionel Messi somehow stays at Paris Saint-Germain, then Bernardo is going to Barca. If Messi goes to Barca, then Bernardo is coming to Paris Saint-Germain. I don't see him staying with Manchester City. He's been like this for over a year. He was part of the Laporte, the Cancelo, these players that Pep wanted out. But obviously, they have a... I don't know, refound their relationship towards the end of the season, which is great for City and Pep and Bernardo. But I think Bernardo still wants to leave. City still are okay with letting him go. And Pep, same with him. So I'm going to give this transfer an 8 out of 10 possibility happening. I, th I, I very think Messi will leave to Barca and Bernardo will come to Paris Saint-Germain. But as I said, if it's not possible, if, if, if Messi... Can't go to Barca. I see him staying at Paris Saint-Germain because I don't see him to go into any other club. I don't think El Hilal, he wants to go there yet. Same with Inter Miami. So, yeah. Messi is very dependable on this transfer. But I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 because I believe Messi will leave Paris Saint-Germain, which will open the door for Bernardo Silva and make it pretty much impossible for Bar Barca to get Bernardo. They're also looking at a right back and a DM and a, and a striker. So Bernardo is not one of their priorities. Was Bernardo is a priority for Paris Saint-Germain. Let me know in the comments down below. Would you take Bernardo Silva to Paris Saint-Germain? And do you see a, an 8 out of 10? Do you see that likely happening? Let me know in the comments down below. Other than that, smash the like button as usual. Subscribe to the PGN YouTube channel. As always, ale ale, ale bye.